Time for another restaurant story. So this story is a submission from this person on Instagram. Um, and it's going to start in a way that you've seen a lot of restaurant stories start. Um, but it is going to end in a way you have never seen any restaurant story on this channel end. So stick with it. Hi there. Welcome. How are you doing this evening? Hi. Um, I'm looking at your menu and like, why is all of your food weird? Why is it weird? Yeah, I haven't heard of any of these dishes. They're all like eight syllables long. What's a what's a spanakapa spanakapa papa patita? Yeah, so we are a Mediterranean restaurant with Greek and Italian food. So what you're reading is uh, the name of some traditional Greek dishes. Well, where's your normal food? Like the normal food with the normal names. Okay, so I know that what you mean by that is American food, but that's kind of mean and I want you to feel bad. So what I'm going to say instead is, well, since this is a Mediterranean restaurant, this is the normal food. Well, you need to tell us what to get, because how am I supposed to know what any of this gibberish means? How am I supposed to know what any of these dishes are? Yeah, so that piece of paper that you're flapping around, um, we call that a menu here. Um, and it's so great because it actually describes what all of the dishes are and lists all of their ingredients. But I'm also happy to give you some recommendations. Um, I personally recommend our Luconico, which is a sliced up kielbasa sausage and a lot of really nice herbs and spices. It's delicious. And we also have our Mediterranean platter, which is our version of like an antipasti plate. So you get a little bit of sampling of everything on our appetizer menu. Okay, yeah, whatever, if that's what you think, since we can't read the fake words here. Yeah, take back these menus with your spacapita pita pacapititu tututas. The word is spanacopita. It's five syllables, okay? So relax. I'll go put in those dishes for you. Okay, just checking on you over here. May I clear these empty plates out of your way because you ate the whole thing? Okay, look, Missy, if you want this place to stay in business, then you're gonna need to put some like normal food on the menu, like burgers. Yeah, yeah, you know, we could. Or, if you wanted burgers, you could go to a burger place instead of a Mediterranean restaurant. Well, we didn't like this food. We didn't like what you recommended to us because it was weird food and not burgers. So just take it off our bill. We're only going to be paying for our drinks today. Oh, um, I'm sorry that you didn't enjoy the food. Um, I wish that you had said something when I did my two-bite check-in and I asked you if you liked the food and you said yes. Um, but unfortunately, since you did eat everything, I am not going to be able to take that off your bill today. Okay, you're talking crazy? That's crazy talk that you're doing. So, get us your manager. Okay, yeah, word. Let me go grab him. Hi, it's me, the manager. What's going on? Yeah, your stupid, dumb, idiot waitress won't take our food off the bill, even though we didn't like it. Okay, don't talk about my staff that way. And you know what? I'm not a regular manager. I'm a cool manager. So why don't you just pay your bill and then get out of my restaurant? No, oh, that's ridiculous. I don't think we should have to do that. Well, I cannot believe how this place is being handled. I simply can't believe it. Great. You two can cry it out and we'll be by to pick up your payment. Wow, those two are a piece of work. Yeah, do you think they're going to actually pay? Well, they're required to by law, so we'll see. Hey, has that couple paid yet? No, they've been, like, messing around on their phones for the past 15 minutes. Eh, I play Candy Crush when I'm angry, too. Da 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 County Sheriff! County Sheriff! Hands in the air, now! Whoa, what? We got a call back at the station that there's an active hostage situation in the restaurant. Oh my god, uh... Here? Oscar, who am I looking for? Our anonymous tip says we're looking for a beautiful young woman with flowing pink hair and a dashing man with sport glasses. Oh, yes, officer! That's us! Thank God you're here! You two called it in? While sitting quietly in the booth alone? Yes, sir! The restaurant's holding us hostage! Won't let us go until we pay our bill! Is that not what you do at a restaurant? Oh, you have got to be- God, I don't get paid enough. I'm so sorry, officer. Um, clearly, these folks are not in any danger. There's just a dispute over the check. Mm-hmm. False alarm, Oscar. It's just another dinner bill-related hostage call. That is very sad. It is. Now, 
pay your bill or don't. I don't care. Ha! See? He said that we didn't have to pay the bill. Okay, you know what? I can't look at your stupid faces anymore. So how about you just tip your server who's still standing over there with her hands up and then you can just go. Okay? Th then we'll be even. <laughs> Fine. Here's a 10. Goodbye. We are going to go to that burger place. Have we called the police there yet? Only one way to find out. I'm going to go get a shot from the bar. You want one? Make it three, please.